And here's the man from every man's nightmare sting, looking to create some more nightmares here. The unpredictability of a triple threat match makes this almost impossible to predict. Any one of these three can walk out of here the winner. The vigilante sting has such a fear-inducing presence. I wouldn't want to be the guy he points that bat at. Yeah, but even without the bat, he can cause some serious damage with the scorpion death drop or the scorpion death lock. Oh, just inflicting so much damage to the body. possesses immeasurable intensity and devastating power. We're looking at one of the strongest forces to ever step foot in a ring. But what has driven him in the most is being a superhero for his son. Inside the ring now. This might be it! Oh my! Byron alluded to Goldberg's motivations for his return. To millions of people around the world, Goldberg is a real-life superhero. His return was able to inspire a new generation in the WWE universe. Even I got caught up in the whirlwind, feel-good story of Goldberg's return to WWE. The man is, in many ways, superhuman. And what a reversal from Sting. DDT! Climbing up, guys, here we go! Oh, boy. Momentum not on the Nature Boy side. Don't be surprised if he shrugs it off and comes back more motivated than ever. Well, I don't expect this to be the nail in the coffin, but it definitely isn't ideal. If he wants to be able to climb the ladder, he's really going to have to minimize the effects of this attack. You seem more motivated than ever heading into this match, which makes me think he still has plenty of fight left in him. Back in the ring now. Staying in a bad way here. Ooh. He can't rest on his laurels here. There are two other guys in there that want this match just as much as he does. He obviously came into this match intent on taking the fight to the outside as much as he could. Though I'm not sure that's the right approach. Yeah, but if you count them out now, guys, you'd be making a very big mistake. Mark my words. It was surreal to see Goldberg back in WWE. The energy and intensity that followed him his entire career returned to Monday Night Raw. And it brought him to Fastlane against Universal Champion Kevin Owens. Goldberg was an uncaged animal during his return to WWE. But Kevin Owens displayed his mastery of mind games, making Goldberg wait until Spear Jackhammer, new champion. There he goes, crashing to the floor. I want to revisit Goldberg versus Kevin Owens. It is absurd that KO had to defend his Universal Championship against Goldberg. Owens didn't have the proper time to prepare, and Goldberg didn't climb the ranks in order to properly earn a title shot. Uh, then you'll love this, Corey. Goldberg is the only superstar to be crowned WCW World Heavyweight Champion, WWE World Heavyweight Champion, and the WWE Universal Champion. Super kick! Showing off some of his speed there. Looks like Goldberg is starting to fade. His chances of winning this triple threat match are starting to dwindle. At this point, they both look to be about evenly matched. Maybe I'd give him an edge, but not by much. And there's the reversal from Sting. Oh boy, he is rolling. And Sting slips out of harm's way. And Ric Flair reverses it. Oh, what incredible power! Wow, what a vertical suplex! 
He oh! I knew it was only a matter of time. Ric Flair taking a beating here. You can't argue with the results. Nobody controls the pace of Stinger Splash. No one does it better. Wow, I'm just as surprised as you guys are. And Sting might have just secured the victory. Goldberg is looking golden right now. And the DDT! He's got that ladder right where he wants it. Now what? Making the climb here, guys! Oh! Going for the win here! You gotta pull like you've never pulled before! Come on! Let's get another look at what made that ladder match so exciting. These fans got their money's worth in this one, as you can see right here. Here is your winner, the man, Cold Steve. That's a big win for him.